Happy Sunday morning, all my YouTube viewers. This is Leo Vallant, your YouTube Messiah. And I moved on from YouTube, and now I'm looking at the MSN news feed. I'm, I'm still in the news. I have a trending, and sometimes trending news is just bullshit. Conservatives upset by new 14 trillion reparations proposal. Yeah, as I did a video about that, it's Cori Bush. She's still going at it. Okay, what I thought of is a compromise. I was, I've been watching a lot of uh, GP, Gordon Peterson, and he had this one idea that if you walk a, a, per, a homeless person on the street, their problem... Just one of their problems is that they're homeless. They, they will have 50 other problems. It's, it's a complex. It's, now, blacks aren't homeless. It's, in fact, it's um, usually when they say they have street smarts, probably street smarts means that they're smart enough to have a place to go <laughs> when the sun goes down. You know, after, after spending their night in the streets and, and brawling and half getting into trouble and half trying to get away from trouble. It's, they're smart enough to have a place to go home to. But just because they're not homeless doesn't mean that they don't have a lot of problems. We look at the black community and we go, holy crap, just all the capital that goes into this friggin' neighborhood, it just leaks out. It doesn't end up in any black pockets. It's why did it take Koreans moving from Korea to open up all the shops and bodegas in the, in the black communities? Why did Koreans have to do that? The property... Hell, it's a Korean goes into a bank, it can hardly understand them, right? How are these... Koreans are able to assemble that capital. It's, hey, it's magic. It's, I don't even know how Koreans do it. Blacks don't either. So my compromise is not 14 or 17 trillion dollars, but Congress can establish a bank. A bank that will only entertain loans toward this class of reparation deservers. But the bank will be told it's there will just be one deposit from the federal government. The initial capital, whatever that is, stop right there. After that, for the bank to survive... It must be able to generate a profit. It's as it lends money out, it has to get more money. Just break even, lend out, come back even. It'd be nice if they got even more money because that would mean give them more political power. Wealth is always power. And so the only way they can grow is they must be selective. Not only selective, but like I say, it's you cannot teach a... By giving money to a black doesn't turn them into a Korean. What you have to do is, I guess you just have to hire a lot of Korean consultants. Just bring them in, bring them in. How the hell do you people grow money? Hard work, hard work. Hard work. I mean, is there another trick besides hard work? No, 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 no. It takes hard work, hard work, hard work. You see, it's going to be a process to bring wealth into the black community. Jeez. Okay. That's under five minutes. That's a good rant. Thank you, everybody.